everyone welcome back to adult series of celebrity interviews and today we have super cool and super energetic ansh with us let's see what makes ansh click and what makes him tick hi ansh how are you today just like every day fine <laughs> okay and can you please introduce yourself for our viewers Hi everyone my name is Anch and I am 11 years old All right Anch So when you wake up every day is there something that you look forward to something that makes you happy I look forward to turning on my laptop I just love the sound of the windows when my laptop starts maybe it is because of my love for technology Ah so you really love technology is it Yes ma'am Well that brings me to my next question. Is there something that you are really really good at? Yes sir, yes there are things which I am good at like doing beat box, doing mischief for which I get scolding from my mother and I am also a tech savvy. You're also a tech savvy. Yes. But you like doing mischief. <laughs> all right, all right. And well uh, that's a very interesting thing you love beat boxing. All right, excellent. So, Ansh, do you have any stuffed animals or stuffed toys with you? Yes. Okay. So, if your stuffed animals could talk, what do you think they would say to you? I guess they would ask me to leave them alone, as they, uh, they have been torn and stitched so many times, and now they are locked in a box under my bed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> So Ansh do you usually dream while you sleep? Yeah. And what are your dreams usually about? Becoming a billionaire, ha- having a collections of PCs and all the games and gaming mouses. Having a collection of games, gaming mouses. Well, you are a tech savvy person, so that explains a lot. All right. So now Anj let me move on to some pretend questions. Okay? Now here you would have to pretend like someone and answer the question that way. So if you were a photographer for a day, what would you photograph? Motherboard under the UV lights looks fantastic. I would like to photograph them and even an interested person would get amazed by looking at it. Ah other boards under uv lights with that does sound fascinating all right okay so now um i know you are just 11 years old anush but is there something that you like to do or you would like to do all by yourself without the help of your parents yes i want to open my own business at the age of 16 well big plans Yeah, I am saving money that was given by my relatives, okay. and and I use that as my investment. I would use that as my investment, and in case I that decided doesn't works well, then I would just use this money for my further studies. Okay, well, your first plan is to open a business. What type of a business do you have? Anything in mind? Uh, which will just give me some profit at that time okay so any business any brand or any industry that's blooming when you're 16 yeah okay well fair enough all right and if that doesn't work out you also have a backup plan so that's a smart thing all right great now let me ask you another pretend question so if you were a superhero all right What would be your name, and what would be your superpower? My name would be Techno, and I will have the superpower to control any gadget in the world. For example, if my fridge, my refrigerator is just not cooling well, with the help of my mind power, I will decrease it so much that if even Antarctica doesn't cool that much. Ooh, so it will make your refrigerator colder than Antarctica. Yeah. Oh my god. 
So that's some superpower that you have. So Anj, if you could make any three rules for your home, what would they be? First, give me give me personal space. Second, I should be allowed to do anything I want. Third, keep my brother miles away from me. You want to keep your brother miles away from you? Yeah. Why is that? Because he's so annoying. Oh, and he's your younger brother? Yeah. Well, well, well. It's, I think there there's always been that um, you know tiff between siblings. Well, I can understand that. I also have a sibling. Right? Yeah. So I can understand the tiff that is there. But don't worry. I think as we grow up, our siblings become our best friends. Yeah. So you just need to wait for that to happen. <laughs> All right, Dutch. Now let's move on to some questions about animals. So if you could ask a question to any wild animal, what would you ask? I would ask an eagle that when you hit your beak on the stone or pluck off your fur feathers when you become old, how are you able to endure so much pain? Okay. So, do you mean to say that when an eagle becomes old, they pluck their own feathers? Yeah. Why do they do that? So that the strong and the strong feathers and the beak beak regrows. Ah, so they actually pluck their own feathers out and hit their beak on a stone, yeah. so that the new one regenerates. That's a really interesting question, Ansh. Yeah, ma'am. It's very painful for an eagle. It's painful for an eagle, and you would like to know how do you endure so much pain? Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Well, well. Now just come on to some happy memories. Okay. So now I would like to know from you that is there any memory when you look back, when you look down the memory lane? Is there any memory that makes you really, really happy? The memory that makes me happy is my birthday of last year, 2020. My birthday was on uh, October 2nd, and my family had just recovered from COVID-19. Oh, so kept a party, but we ordered the food, and after a long time, and the best best part was my mother was always also free all day. Otherwise, she is always in the kitchen and busy. Ah, so that was the best part of your birthday. Well, I'm glad to know that everyone in your family recovered from COVID. All right, that's a good thing. I like that the best part for you was that your mom was free that day. And yeah, that's that sweet thought. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, since we are talking about parties and you know. Things we like to eat. How about I ask you one more uh, creative question? So, if you could eat only one thing for a whole week, what would you like to eat? Thing whole week. Whole week. Um. Then probably I would choose dark chocolate. Dark chocolate. So, are you a big fan of dark chocolate? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh. And you can have them all three times a day. Yeah. Well, well, we have a chocolate lover right here. Yes, I would, I would do, won't need that much because even a one bit, I mean, even a one bite of that uh, chocolate would give me so much calorie that I can do work all day. So you wouldn't feel hungry? No, ma'am, because it gives us uh, so, so much calorie. Ah, okay. So that's a smart choice as well, and something that you also like. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Well, let me just ask you one more question about animals. Do you like animals, and do you, you know, do you have a pet? No. You don't have a pet. But okay. would you like one? Yeah. Okay. If it was allowed. So, if it was allowed. Okay. Well, let me just start my question that way. So, if it was allowed for you to have a pet. Which animal would you choose? If I was allowed to keep a pet, then I would keep a lion, a dog, a cat, a 
um actually all the animals all the animals including yeah. wild animals yeah but how would you take care of them i would divide the area in a particular sections and uh, cover it with the cage, cage cover it with the cage and uh, so the animal doesn't escape and harm the animal or get or just get harm by hmm. other animal all right all right so we will keep them separate but also want to give them the feeling of a jungle yeah okay all right all right well now i come to my last question tanj so i would like to ask if you have any message for your parents anything that you would like to uh, say to your parents that i love them and everything they do for me is just out outstanding how lovely it's really lovely to see that you acknowledge their love and their effort that they put for you <laughs> lovely anj great well thank you so much anj i had a really good interaction with you more power to you and thank you once again bye 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 ma'am yay